Will the House come to order? The gentleman from Ohio. Wait a I'm going to go forward. Recognized. Madam Speaker, pursuant to Clause 2 of Rule 9, I rise to give notice of my intent to raise a question of the privileges of the House. The form of the resolution is as follows. The House is not in order. Please proceed. The form of the resolution is as follows. A resolution, Articles of Impeachment of George Bush, President of the United States, resolved that President George W. Bush be impeached for high crimes and misdemeanors and that the following Articles of Impeachment be exhibited to the United States Senate. Articles of impeachment exhibited by the House of Representatives of the United States of America in the name of itself and of the people of the United States of America in maintenance and support of its impeachment against President George W. Bush for high crimes and misdemeanors. In his conduct while President of the United States, George W. Bush, in violation of his constitutional oath to faithfully execute the office of President of the United States, and to the best of his ability, preserve, protect, and defend the Constitution of the United States, and in violation of his constitutional duty to take care that the laws be faithfully executed, has committed the following abuses of, po of power. Article 1, creating a secret propaganda campaign to manufacture a false case for war against Iraq. In his conduct while President of the United States, George W. Bush, in violation of his constitutional oath to faithfully execute the office of President of the United States and to the best of his ability, preserve, protect, and defend the Constitution of the United States, and in violation of his constitutional duty under Article 2, Section 3 of the Constitution to take care that the laws be faithfully executed, has both personally and acting through his agents and subordinates, together with the Vice President, illegally spent public dollars on a secret propaganda campaign to manufacture a false cause for war against Iraq. The Department of Defense has engaged in a years-long secret domestic propaganda campaign to promote the... The will suspend. The House will come to order. Please proceed. The Department of Defense has engaged in a years-long secret domestic propaganda campaign to promote the invasion and the occupation of Iraq. The secret program was defended by the White House press secretary following its exposure. This program follows the pattern of crimes detailed in Articles 1, 2, 4, and 7. Strike that, 8. The mission of this program placed it within the field controlled by the White House Iraq group, known as WIG, a White House task force formed in August 2002 to market an invasion of Iraq to the American people. The group included Carl Rove, I. Lewis Libby, Condoleezza Rice, Karen Hughes, Mary Matlin, Stephen Hadley, Nicholas E. Callio, and James R. Wilkinson. The White House Iraq group, or WIG, produced white papers detailing so-called intelligence of Iraq's nuclear threat that later proved to be false. This supposed intelligence included the claim that Iraq had sought uranium from Niger, as well as the claim that the high-strength uranium tubes Iraq purchased from China were to be used for the sole purpose of building, of building centrifuges to enrich uranium. Unlike the National Intelligence Estimate of 2002, the Whigs White Paper provided quote, gripping images and stories, unquote, and use, quote, literary license, unquote, with intelligence. The White House Iraq Group's white papers were written at the same time and by the same people as speeches and talking points prepared for President Bush and some of his top officials.